In a nutshell, browser or HTTP cookies are text files that contain packets of information about your browsing history. They help websites recognize your computer so that they can serve content much faster when you return. They also store details such as your username and password. This way, you don't have to re-enter your credentials each time you check into a website. Apart from better usability and faster loading speeds, cookies are also useful for marketers. For instance, suppose you're looking up cameras on Amazon. After you leave the site, you might notice related ads on social media. This level of personalization is possible because your browser lets Amazon read your history. From your perspective, you don't have to take any action apart from agreeing to cookies as you enter the site. Cookies are generally safe to use and don't contain any malware. Here are some of the common examples you will encounter. Session cookies, which are deleted as soon as your session ends. Persistent cookies, which are used for website authentication. Secure cookies, which are used by encrypted websites as protection against hackers. Third-party cookies, which are found on pages with ads that grant access to external parties, even if you don't click on any of the ads. And finally, zombie cookies, which are troublesome as they can install permanently on your computer even if you opt out. The last two types cause a lot of concern since they track and store data without your explicit permission or knowledge. Depending on the country, there are laws that regulate the use of third-party cookies. For instance, businesses with EU-based customers must follow the GDPR and the e-privacy directive. GDPR states that online identifiers, such as cookies, qualify as personal data, so companies can only process them with the user's consent. This is why you often see cookie opt-in messages as you enter a website. Not all cookies are bad though. On the contrary, many are essential for the site to function correctly. With all of that said, here are some practical tips to keep your online privacy in check. Review your browser's privacy settings. Delete cookies every so often. Use a proxy server. Browse in private mode. Avoid questionable sites and keep your browser up to date. There you go. That's a quick look at cookies. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a like and subscribe for more content. With that said, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.